Okay guys, we were waiting for this IPO to open up and PAGS just opened up. That's the second one minute candle. Let me refresh the four very important IPO rules. Rule number one, you only go long. Rule number two, you only buy over the five minute high and the high in this case is 28.35. Rule number three, it has to come with more than 1 million share volume and this one already has 19 million shares. Rule number four, it has to be over the IPO price and this one is already up by 30%. So everything really clicks in together. It has been a while since I've seen such a perfect looking IPO. So the only thing that is missing now is that we go long over the five minute high. And again, 28.35 is the highs as you can see here in the first candle. It pulled back which is perfect. I'm getting ready to go long and this one is something I haven't seen for a long long time. Such a perfect looking IPO over 30% up. I mean usually you see them up by 2 or 3 or 5%. This one's up 30% and 20 million shares by now and that means only one thing. People are interested. People are going to go long especially if it moves over the highs. Here come the fourth candle and I really 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 want it not to move over the highs now. Oh, come on don't do that. Don't do that. It's moving higher. I want it to go long. I want to go long only if it moves over the fifth candle. Oh boy, it just touched the highs. Please don't go. Wait another candle, just touch the highs again. It's getting perfect. It's getting to be a perfect trade. If it pulls back down now and the fifth candle comes in, that would be perfect. Exactly by the rules. Oh, please don't go. Fifth candle, please. Okay, I'm going all in. This one is just the perfect IPO formation. I haven't seen this one for a long, long time. I'm going all in right now. I'm going to go long 60,000 shares. Oh, look at this pullback here. The only thing I'm afraid of now that it's going to come down and not move over the highs. Here's the fifth candle. Great. Can it move higher? Can we go over the highs? I'm getting ready to buy. I will go along 60,000 shares. Come on, come on, come on, come on. You can do it, you can do it. It's okay to go long if it goes over the highs at the 7th or the 8th, even the 10th candle. So I'm still waiting for it to make a decision here. And the fact that it touched the highs twice and bounced, that makes it a perfectly looking IPO trade. Getting ready to go long. In fact, if it touches the highs once more and bounces once more, that would even look better. Okay, this is really looking perfect. I'm getting ready to go long. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Come on, come on. You can do it. Six candle. That's good, that's good. Touch the highs, getting ready to go long. Another bounce. That would really look perfect now. Good. We've got another bounce. That shows that we have resistance. Oh, this is great. Okay, come down and up again. Down and up again. I'm all in, guys. I'm all in on this one. It should go. Okay, six candle. More than ten would usually be a little bit too much. Six is perfect. Actually, five is perfect, but six is even better. Traders, I'm so sure it's going to go through. I'm actually going to buy now. I'm buying now. Bought. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I just bought 60,000 shares. You got to go now. You have to go. Oh, please do. There you go. Okay. Average price, 28.99. Perfect. Volume should grow now. We should see the volume growing as it moved to a new high. Go on, baby. Yes, yes. <laughs> okay. I was risking approximately 35 cents. The loss was 28. As you can see here, the whole number. I would love to get it somewhere over 28.70. Don't watch the chart now. Only watch the level two buyers. This is much more important. I'm getting ready to sell. This is my perfect trade. Oh, we just moved over 70. I took my partial. Oh, that was a perfect trade. I can't believe that happened so nicely. No pullback whatsoever. No pullback whatsoever. Did I sell too quick? 
I don't know, it's holding here at the 2870s. No, it's over the 80s now. Well, I was risking 30 cents or so, 35 cents, and that was approximately my partial. And here are the results of my best trade this year, PAGS up $25,000. However, if you take a look at my account, I'm only up $15,000, and that means that before having this perfect trade, I was having my worst day this year. I was down 10 grand. And uh, PAGS really saved my day. So both at the same day, my worst trading day this year and my best trade this year. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you for watching my video. Do you have what it takes to become a trader? I would like to invite you to take my free trading challenge. If you succeed, I will fund you. You will get free access to a $14,000 trading account which you can trade from home and earn 70% of the profits you generate. No risk, no cost. Just click here and join now. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel here. If you have any questions, Please use the comments below.